Hello friends and welcome back to another Roller Coaster Tycoon playthrough video. We are getting back to the original Roller Coaster Tycoon and going to the next park in our list, the first challenging park, Trinity Islands, where the objective is to have 750 guests in the park by the end of year three, with a park rating of 600. First things first, let's open the park. Okay, that's free, that's good. In Roller Coaster Tycoon 1, because I have the option of paying per ride or paying at the entrance, I like to pay per ride, so that's what we will do. To start, to initiate our new park, let's build a merry-go-round. The soul of Roller Coaster Tycoon 2. I should not have made that go down. What am I doing? <laughs> go over that space. Very nice, very nice. Ba, 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 ba. Very nice. Okay, our first ride is open. I'm gonna leave the price where it is because if I charge much more than that, people will not pay for it, which is frustrating, but whatever. It is what it is. Now, I, go, I think the, uh, the so-called challenging aspect of this park is the terrain, obviously. Building over water is expensive, building over hills is expensive, and knocking down trees is expensive. So let's try to save these flat spots for our flat rides which are supposed to be cheap. And then the all the water and hilly spots can be reserved for our roller coasters. Seems like the smart thing to do. Let's fire this up. Let's see, let's go with the wooden supports with a concrete path, concrete stairs. Oh, that's right, I forgot, it's a ramp. In Roller Coaster Tycoon 1, it's a ramp. In Roller Coaster Tycoon 2, you actually get stairs. So that's odd. Let's get some fun green paths, because why not? Boop. There we go. And let's open this one. I think we can get away with charging $3 for this, at least for the first few months. After a while, it becomes a... Uh, uh, you're not... After a while, that's too much. Because the value... It's like it depreciates. The value... Oops. The value of the ride decreases with... Oh, what the heck is going on with my mouse wheel? With time. So this apparently is the only roller coaster I have access to. Does this place have two entrances? Oh no, I'm I'm just dense. <laughs> I rotated and forgot where I was. I like I got disoriented. Disorientated. Oh wait, first I want to turn this up to. Never mind, it's already maxed out. That's weird. I've always seen it default to uh, not maxed out at least. Let's build this five feet above the water for no particular reason other than. Realistically, we wouldn't want the ride to get flooded in a rainy season. All right, can I put lift? Uh, I can't do that. Okay, lift hill. Right over our island. Oh, I forgot we can do this. Yeah, as you've as you as you all have seen, I have been playing Roller Coaster Tycoon 2 for the past two videos I released, so I'm a little uh, uh, out of practice. I'm a little unfamiliar with the differences of Roller Coaster Tycoon 1. This ride can helix. Let's not go all the way down to the water. Oh wait, no, that's right. The water is at negative five feet, isn't it? Uh, height marks on land. Negative five is the water level. Yeah, that's weird. All right. Anyway, that means we can do this. I... Whoa, don't freeze on me! There we go. From 45 to 40, that's not gonna work. <laughs> I don't think that'll work. Oh, look at that, it worked! Okay. Well, just to, f just to figure out exactly where these are going to go, let me build these, the entrance and the exit real quick, just to make sure they will actually fit under this track. Oops, that was the wrong button. Okay, that looks good. Very nice, very nice. Undo that, because that was a mistake. This will go up to 15, to 20. Back down. Whoa, not that low. <laughs> Here we go. At negative, not negative, at five feet. 
Let's bring this down to zero. The last little drop there and breaks. I cannot do that. Okay. Uh, how about we go a little wider? This could be a problem. Unless I added the land a little bit. Oh, never mind. I thought I was going to have to make it slope down over there. Uh, here, where I don't have room to because I'd have to put a turn there. But never mind, no problem. Let's put bricks right here. Very nice. So now we have a complete circuit. <clears throat> we can have two trains. What color are these? You know, the stats in these are so pathetic. Let's reverse these. We'll call this, uh... We'll call this the, uh... What should we name this? Bug under influence. B-U-I. <laughs> B-U-I. I, I hope that doesn't stand for something inappropriate. I have no idea what the acronym is meant to stand for. I'm just making up acronyms. <laughs> okay, let's follow... Let's follow train one and see what it does. I know we're not going to have any serious G-Force problems, so I'm not, not even going to watch. Oop, duck. Haha, <laughs> quacked the duck as it was moving. Weehoo! Oh yeah. And then get caught by the brakes. Slow down to a nice speed. Alright, release the camera, please. Wow, we only have 70... We only have 80-something guests, but it seems like they're everywhere. Oh yeah, because our park is so tiny. Oh, canoes! How useless. Okay, stats please. Oh, look at that! It looks like reversing it did make a difference. Although, I forgot to turn this up! Speed up the throughput. Anyway, I suppose I could probably charge $10 for this. I think, I hope, maybe, kinda, sorta. Oops. Open. There we go. Any takers? Peeps! Wait! Ha 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 Get quacked, you green-headed mallard! Ho ho! How does it feel to be quacked? I hope it tickles. Enough madness from me. Okay, I would do this, but I want to match the color of the paths everywhere else. So let's connect these up, like so. Make a complete circuit here. Okay, that connects. And I guess we'll let this loop around, that's fine. It's a little awkward, but it, it works. Okay, what are the thoughts of the people passing by this roller coaster? Oh, they're probably not getting in line until they see the results, actually. Uh, anybody? Maybe the duck should ride it. What are you doing down there? That's right, get quacked, you mallard! Okay. Now do we get the stats? There we go. Now will people get in line? Maybe we should advertise it. Uh, B-U-I, bug under the influence, because <laughs> it's backwards. <laughs> That's such a dumb joke. Oh my gosh, no one's getting in line. No one's even turning down this path. Uh, anyway, let's see, we have some water rides available. Oh, I have no exit, whoops. Let's fix that. There we go. Pack the ducks a few more times. Okay, he's getting a line, so $10 appears to not be too expensive. We have a boat hire, which includes all these categories. They're just grouped together. Uh, the boat hire is kind of useless as far as money goes, but I, eh, I might be able to attract more people to the park with it. But first, infrastructure for the peeps. Let's have a bathroom over the beach. Why am I frozen? What is happening? Okay. I see how it is. Set that to 40 cents so I can nickel and dime every last penny people have. Let's get some uh, drinkses. Okay, I don't want to overdo it with the price. And ice cream. What better place to have ice cream than the beach where it's hot. Or I hope it's hot. Actually, where I leave the beach usually is not hot. It's usually kind of cold, actually. Okay, I hope ice cream passes as food, because that's the only food option we have. We built our only thrill ride, our only roller coaster. We could add some of these. Uh, 
Let's see. Does this fit in the middle here? It does not. Oh, but it does fit here. But I shouldn't put it there, I just realized, because I don't... Uh, <laughs> I would have to... That the entrance and the exit wouldn't fit, so instead we'll put it right here. Actually, let's put this in the water. We'll say that it floods by design, so you have to trod through water while you're inside. Okay. Shabang! What are the stats? Whoops. Not bad. I think we can charge. What was the max? Five dollars for this? Probably not. But there's someone's gonna reject it. Oh, what'd you turn around for, dude? Oh, he's going to the roller coaster. Bug under the influence. What about this guy? He wants to go on something more thrilling. I'm not paying that much. That's what I was looking for. Okay, let's change it to four dollars. Will anyone pay four dollars for this? Okay, those guys. Okay, yeah, that's way too expensive. Three dollars it is! Take it or leave it. Actually, I think that is the max I can charge for this, uh, if I recall correctly from... I think it was Bumbly Beach where I've had some, one of these at that price. I don't know. Let's see... Holy smoke, this is enormous. Uh, let's look at the financials. We are making a little bit of money from ride tickets, just $250. That's pathetic. Although this one... Oh, it all came from this one ride. <laughs> There's no one riding these other... Th okay, people are riding it. What the heck? Okay, most of it came from here. I guess this doesn't account for the, uh, the running costs. I don't know. Advertise campaign has finished. What are we researching? Ooh, a log flume. That'll be good. That'll be nice to add to our repertoire of park stuff. I think we should have a chairlift that takes people from the entrance all the way to the uh, the very end of the park. So let's build one of those. Custom design. And you'll get your feet wet if the water rises. Seems like a fun idea. Okay, I lined that up perfectly. I was trying to go along the edge there, and it looks like it worked. I'm out of money. How much money can I take out, actually? I haven't tested this. Oh, that's, that's the limit. My goodness. Okay. I feel like I should make this taller. Yeah, get some height on here so we have room below it for rides. Let's bring that back, go up. Why are these getting more expensive? I could have sworn these all were the same cost in Rollercoaster Coaster Tycoon 2. Okay, that's the max height we can go. Uh-oh. We don't have a kiosk, no! Okay, we can't cash in on the on the guests for the umbrellas. <laughs> oh no. Okay. That's what is that? 65. We're down to 65 again. You know, let's just go to the edge here. Uh, not over the path. <laughs> that doesn't look safe at all. Okay, and from here, let's go down to the beach. I did not do this correctly. Let's start by dropping this down a ways. Well, actually, no, let's drop it over here. So it's like your toes just skim right over the... Oh, never mind. It's like your toes skim right over the pat, right over the, the hill here. I was still on the way. What am I doing? One more straight piece. A 
My goodness, how much space does this need? Okay then, well, we'll have additional supports, just like that. Wait a minute! That doesn't make sense. What is the support there for if it's not standing on anything? <laughs> what the heck? There we go, that's what I want. Station platform right there at the beach. And let's see, let's max out the number of cars we get. Max out the speed. And turn this down to five seconds. And oh, I need an entrance and an exit before I can test that. Haunted House 1 has broken down. That is not good. I must hire a mechanic. Okay, he'll, fi he'll fix that. And while he's fixing that, we'll finish this. Now it can test. Alright, let's connect everything up. I think we're going to need... A path to connect down here. A beach access path. There we go. Okay, so this is a dead end, so there won't be a lot of traffic going to it, but that's alright. I mostly want to get people from the entrance to that spot. Alright. Now where is chair where's chair number one? Uh let me click it. There we go. It is clear over here. So that's chair one and or car one. Car fifty three is still in the station. How long is it gonna be in the station? I wanna I I wanna uh space this out so it comes out right as chair one gets back, ideally. It doesn't look like it's going to happen, iPad. Okay, 48 still waiting. 51 still... My goodness! Okay, it looks like we have to turn this down, and that'll probably be sufficient. Let's get the stats. Not bad. Let's see. Can we charge $2 for this? Maybe. Well, I'm stuck. Oh, here we go. <laughs> I was trying to scroll and it wouldn't let me. Okay, it looks like people are willing to pay $2. I want to go on something more thrilling than Chairlift 1. Sure you do, sure you do. No problem. Uh, do we have that log flume yet? Yes! We have the log flume! Ooh, and a mini suspended coaster. That's the hairpin coaster, right? Oh no, it's this horrible thing. Never mind. <laughs> that sucks. I hate that roller coaster. Where should we build this? Here is another ride where it is good to have it down at the water level. And I forgot again, I only need two station pieces. Why do I always forget that? It had to be done. There was no, no escaping that fact. Okay, I think this is as tall as we can go, so let's drop back down. And uh, in real life, the boat would probably fly off the track right here. <laughs> Actually, no. In real life, there'd probably be an embank uh, some kind of uh, raised wall here for the car to bump up against. So no problem. Actually, do I have room to delay that and put a photo section here? I do not. Darn it. Okay. Well, we'll turn instead, and then photo section. And then drop like so. Do I fit here? I do not. That sucks. Okay, how about 
Oh, that doesn't work either. Okay, that was a bad idea. Okay, it looks like I can't do this either. Let's bring it back down to the water level. Man, no matter what I do, I keep just not doing it right. Oh, that doesn't work. Okay, fine. Let's go to zero feet. So we're slightly above the water level. That way we can do that. And turn so we don't crash into the station platform there. Not station platform, the, uh, the key line. Uh-oh. I'm screwing up my supports. No! Maybe... No! That's not working. How do I... How do I bring this back to the station? What the heck? I apologize if I sound a little tired. I spent uh, the last few days working in the blistering heat. It was, uh, we had two days back to back that reached 97 degrees Fahrenheit. I'm not sure what the Celsius conversion is, but uh, suffice it to say that is extremely hot. Well, maybe, maybe you live in Arizona and you're laughing at that. It's, uh, Based relative to my what I'm used to as far as uh, heat, it was very hot. So I worked outside all day, both of those days, taking care of horses and such. Um, I got burned. So, and then I had the bright idea of going to the gym on those days after work. So I'm a little burned out, literally, uh, you know, burned. Get it? <laughs> so I am a bit tired, but I'll try to be energized and energetic for this video. I'll do my best, but no promises of high, heightened levels of energy. Uh, is this lined up? It is, but it's too too high up, darn it. Gosh dang it, that's not going to work. And that's not going to work either. No! Ha, uh, yeah, ha, huh. this does not work. Okay, let's just rethink this entire freaking thing. I spent so long on this log flume, what the heck? No! That doesn't work either. Okay. That doesn't fit, so let's do this. Photo section as you go under the track seems like a good spot for it. What's the, uh... Okay, so I do have room to go over the path here. And even to drop, like so! Woohoo! Now we're talking! That's progress. Okay, reverse turn table just to make things interesting. It's not particularly big, but we don't have a lot of money after all. We maxed out our loan. So let's, uh, let's test it out. Wait, wait, no, don't test it out. Let's make sure we have the maximum number of boats. Oh, we do. Never mind. Okay. <laughs> test it out. And five seconds. No, four seconds between each boat? I don't know. There goes boat one. And we still don't have a info kiosk, unfortunately. Oh, we have a Ferris wheel. I missed that. Okay, good to see there are people on here. Looks like there are... How many people are on the ride? Uh, there's a lot of people on the ride. Where does it say? 
Oh, I need to click on the overall view. Uh, there we go. 46 people on right. Not bad. That's like a... That's almost a fifth of the whole park. <laughs> what are we doing financially? Eh, not bad for a small ride like this. That's actually not, not very good. No one's complaining about the price, but... Uh, I'm scared if I charge more, no one will pay for it. Okay. Very nice stats, very nice. Let's turn this up, as we always do. Actually, I think someone told me there was an optimal price for this, but I don't remember what it was. So let me make that a little cheaper. Oh, that's an entrance fee. What am I doing? Let's try $10. Make the photo $3. Same price throughout park. Oh, I forgot. <laughs> I need an entrance. What am I doing? I am out of sorts today, people. All right, log flume has no path leading from its exit. Yeah, no kidding. I noticed. Because I was being stupid and didn't realize I was messing it up. Oh, shoot. I probably should have placed the exit in a different spot. That's easy to fix. Boom! Oh yeah! Oh, I f f f fail. <laughs> there we go. Okay. Are people getting on this raid? Oh, they are. That's good. All right. Let's move on to other things. I saw we have a Ferris wheel now, so let's put that somewhere. Maybe on a high spot. Right there. Or, uh, hmm. Here. That is too expensive. I can't afford it. Come on, pizza. I need you to pay for tickets. Tickets, please. I'll just uh, do the smart financial thing, which is borrow money. <laughs> please don't tell Dave Ramsey I said that. All right. That might be a bit long for a queue line, but it's okay. Let's leave that at $1. That's probably as much as we can get away with. Oh boy, we have a vomit problem. Okay, well, that problem will fix itself, of course, and I just remembered I have not placed any benches or trash cans anywhere in the park. So let's put some there, since this seems to be a vomit producer. Some there. Put a few more over here by the entrance. And that should be sufficient. Wait, just a few more. Okay. That should be sufficient. Let's add some garbage cans. Boom, 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 boom. Boom. Uh-oh, Ferris Wheel 1 has no path leading from his exit! What a fool I have been! There we go. Get that path in place.
Oh, perfect. We have an information kiosk. That means next time it rains, it's payday. So let's put a few of these in strategic places throughout the park. Let's have one close to the entrance. Where's the entrance? Ah, over here. One close to the entrance. Boop. Actually, let's put it right there. And we'll change the cost of maps to 1.20. A dollar and 20 cents. And umbrellas, of course, as always. Oh, no, that's not what I meant to do. Twenty dollars. All right, let's make the, let's leave it at the default, that's fine. Okay, the maps are selling, that's good. Let's have another one in the belly of the park. Preferably at a high traffic intersection. Problem is many of these intersections are on little, heh, <laughs> little slopes like that. So I can't really do it. I wouldn't say this is much of a high traffic area, but it is on the opposite end of the park, so let's do it. Let's change this to light blue. Same prices, that's good. Alright. Okay, this ride is really not producing that much. Guests are hungry and can't find anywhere to buy food. Well, no kidding, I don't have food. I only have ice cream. That's all I got. What are we researching, by the way? We just got the info kiosk. We don't know yet what we're going to research, it seems. Let's turn our loan down while we can. Ooh, a gentle ride, fun. Not particularly useful, but all right. We are about halfway through year one, it seems. Twist one is broken down, that's not good. Okay, let's turn our loan down again. A spiral slide, the icon of Roller Coaster Tycoon. Or roller coaster tech can do at least. Come on. Give me more money. Okay, now we've unlocked it. Turn this down again. Alright. Now as soon as we can afford it, let's build that spiral slide somewhere. This will attract more people to the park, of course, as always. As each ride does. I was actually re-watching some of my old videos, and I was like explaining the technicalities of certain things, such as drawing more guests to the park. I was watching the Bumbly Bazaar video, and I was totally wrong. I was saying that these high stats on this giant roller coaster will attract people to the park. And I'm like, now I'm watching it now, I'm like, no, that's not how it works. <laughs> but sure enough, someone in the comments pointed that out, so that's why current videos are more true to how the game actually works. But it's interesting going back and revisiting some of my old content like that and just seeing how far we've come, and how far you guys have come along with me. So I'm, I am really grateful. We surpassed uh, 500 subscribers a few days ago. I honestly never really thought I would get this far, so I'm really, really excited about that. I'm very grateful to you guys for helping me get this far, so thank you for that. It's kind of a that vague dream idea that he has, like, oh yeah, I wish I could get that far someday, maybe, but I doubt it'll ever happen, and then sure enough, it happened. But maybe that should uh, light a fire under my butt to start actually producing videos again, because I've kind of been uh, slacking. Although in my defense, I've been working five or six days a week, eight-hour days, in the blistering heat, taking care of horses, doing physical labor. So, you know, I'm tired. <clears throat> but I have days off, and I've been wasting them. Oh, but I have another excuse. For the past couple weeks, I've been battling some kind of illness. I think it was a cold. So, but my voice is all funky, my nose is plugged, so it's kind of hard to record in that in that condition. So that's my excuse. Haunted house has no people on it. What's going on here? I am not paying that much, he says. Fine, we'll go back to 150. Now will people ride it? No well, people are getting in line. That's good. Okay, what else has no people on it? The spiral slide has no one on. Oh, yeah, never mind. Oh, on. The twist probably reached the end of its useful life. Having three dollars, let's bring it back down to one fifty. Oh, it's payday! Woohoo! Bring in the dollars. Where, where's my uh, umbrella stand? Oh yeah, look at that! Look at it go! Woohoo! Turn down a loan some more. We are nearly back down to where we started, and we have significantly more than $10,000 worth of stuff in the park, so that's good. Hey buddy, are you gonna buy an umbrella? Oh, there it goes, he bought one. Nice. 
Okay then. There's a lot of people over here not buying them, so maybe we should put another kiosk right there. Open for business and make these green. Oh yeah! What kind of scenery do we have? I never really looked, aside from this stuff. Okay, we have flowers and trees. Great. Really useful. Oh, we have some... Oh, we have some other stuff. We have fountains. Where should we put this fountain? Since we have no room anywhere in there. Okay, one right there. Is that centered? Not quite. <laughs> that works. That's fine. Four, four, four fountains that are centered. Alright, well... We've had a steady income of about... Oh, it's been gradually snowballing, that's good. So it's been gradually climbing an income from ride tickets. But our shop sales last month almost reached a thousand because of those umbrella sales. Oh, that's not last month, that's this month, and we're only halfway through it. So with the regular normal sales of, like, food and drinks, we might actually surpass a thousand for that month. That's good. I think we should advertise our park, get more people inside, and start paying for rides. We are more than halfway towards our objective, and we're only halfway through year one. Let me just make sure. Yeah, 750 guests. That will be easy. Easy, easy, easy. Especially with this crap coaster, if we build one. Because roller coasters tend to draw more guests than flat rides do. I have not built one. Uh, build. Built one of these. So maybe we should build one of these car rides over the water. And I think we incur stat penalties for being too short. So let's make sure we make this a good length. Oh, I don't have room to do that. Darn it! Let's uh, interweave this here with the. Oh, I can't do that. No! Interweave this with the mini roller coaster. So far, no hills, nothing. And I'd like to climb up like so, but it looks like the roller coaster is in the way, so I can't do that. Unless I come down right here. I can't do that either. Do I even have room to go flat through here? Oh, yes, I do. Very nice. Now I'm out of money. Ooh, mine train coaster. That'll be a nice money grabber. After all the money I'm spending on this piece of junk. Notice how I was talking so much about... You know, this is very expensive. How much will I sell for the, get for this? Oh, never mind. It's just a thousand two hundred. In that case, I guess we'll just work with it. We'll see what happens. Uh, how many? What do I get? Let's do racing cars. We get a uh, excitement factor bonus. Fire it up. Change this to five seconds between each car. How many of these do I get actually? Oh, that's the maximum. Okay. Anyway, let's build our entrance to this. Oh, shoot. Uh huh. Okay, how do I do this? <laughs> It's a bit long, but we'll make it work. There we go. That's I probably shouldn't have built it so close to this uh, boardwalk. Uh, anyway. No test results yet. We're still waiting on the first few cars to come back to the station. It looks like I need to shorten this to four seconds. Stats, please. Oh, not bad. All right. $3 to ride in the cars. 
Maybe we'll actually have a profitable one of these for once. Although not a lot of people are interested. We seem to have earned back most of that money. And what do we have? A mine train coaster? Oh yes! That will be a mega money cruncher! So let's take out a big loan and build one. Somewhere. Where we have room. You know, the front of the park is a little empty. Let's build it up build it over here. And I said I was gonna save the flat space for flat rides, but whatever. We're gonna break the railway set for ourselves. And build the entrance right here. Let's see, you get two trains. There we go. Two trains. And a lift hill. Up to 60 feet. Right over the path to scare the guests when a train passes. Now the question is, will 60 feet make it back up to 55 feet? I think it will. Just barely. Oh yeah, look at that. Just crawls right over. Although I am kind of isolating my path a bit, so maybe I shouldn't do that. It's fine. Uh-oh. We cannot do that. We can do that, however. Hello. That's going to be a little messy, but it's fun. I like it. I like it. Now for, the, now, for this style of train, we want to make, give it a kind of a out of control, oh my gosh, this train's about to fly off the rails kind of feeling. If you're not fearing for your life, I am failing as a roller coaster designer. Okay, we bank that one and then don't bank this one. I don't see why that's a problem. <laughs> Down to the water level, splash, get wet in the water. So if the roller coaster tracks get messy, it's part of the experience. When I say messy, I mean they get wet. Now I have doubts as to whether this train is going to make it up this 40 foot hill, so let's see what happens. That's what I like about these little ghost trains, which are not part of the original game. Oh, just I'll barely make it over. Okay. They made it over just fine. Am I lined up with the... Not quite. Okay, let's put some brakes right here to 13 miles per hour. And return to the station. Never mind, what's in the way? Oh, I should have thought of that. Okay. We'll put the brakes over. No, 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 no. Put the brakes over here to 13. Actually, no, we'll set that to 18. So, 18. S bend right. Now we'll have some brakes. Slow down to 13. And back into the station. Beautiful. And we have money to spare. <laughs> we maxed out our loan to do that. <laughs> All right. Let's uh, turn up the lift hill speed to the max. I forgot to add an entrance and an exit to this, so let's do that. Guests can't figure out to what now? Oh, it's the last day of year one. Chairlift one still hasn't been fixed. Where? Where are you? Oh, he's fixing it. But I think that's right, we do need more staff. Because our park's getting bigger. Alright. The safest park in the country! Thank you! I'm happy to see that. Let's follow this along on our masterful, beautiful train. You know, I keep using the same colors over and over for these trains. Let's switch it up. Yeah, that doesn't seem to work. I'm not sure this works either. Woo! Just barely make it over that.
poking along just beautifully. Oh, yes. All right, let's get the stats back from this. I did put a photo section somewhere, right? Oh, yes, I did. I just forgot where. <laughs> I forgot where I put it. Oh, it's right there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right. Stow with stats like these, who needs an enemies? Oh, wait, wrong punchline. Uh, let's go $14, which I think I can get away with. Actually, let's try 15 just for kicks to see if people will pay for it. And what am I doing? I have no entrance. What is wrong with me? Okay, now it's all set up. What was that notification? Oh yeah, I was fixing it as it gave me the notification. And it looks like people are getting in line to pay... <laughs> let lose my voice. To pay $15 for this, so that's good. Very nice, I like to see that. Let's do a quick inventory of our rights. I never painted this roller coaster. what was I thinking? I named it, but I didn't paint it. Let's make it something... Oh. Okay. Green bugs. And we'll give this... Okay, a jungle entrance. That looks cool. Let's give this a canvas tent entrance. Make sure the colors match the actual ride. Very good. And I said I was going to do different colors, but I just used the same default colors. It's always black, white, or brown. Or gray. So what if I do something more radical? Not that radical. Okay, now we have that m muted maroon color, but... I don't know. There's the darker one. Big no! Let's not do that. Oh my gosh. I'm gonna go blind. That's kind of cool, actually. Let's do these pastel colors. Ah! The muted purple looks kind of nice. Still not sure I like it, though. Orange green? No. You know what? Forget it. We're just going to stick with the white. Because that's that, that, that works for this. It's made of wood. Anything else looks funny. I need to cut my grass. Let's cut my grass. Go with the max size. Boom, 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 boom. Okay, with that, everything should be reset. Beautiful. Okay. What are we researching? A pirate ship? Nice. Oh, we have a maze now. Where's the maze? A maze that we can't build anywhere. Because it can only build in flat land. Maybe I should have maintained this. <laughs> Where could I possibly sneak a micro maze in without messing with the landscape too much? Oh, I could do it here. Out of the way, tree. We're building a maze. Okay, there are two dead ends in this maze. Everything else is a straight shot, so this should be just fine. Max people on the ride. He <laughs> immediately went to the dead end twice. What are you doing? What is he doing? This guy's smart. He didn't get stuck like this guy did. This guy's an idiot. <laughs> he went back and forth like three times. What the heck? Anyway. What is this color, though? You know, I actually kind of like that. That's cool. The, the gray tent. Looks metallic. We never named this, so I'm going to come up with something bogus to name it. Uh, let's see. Rickety Rails. It's alliteration, but not particularly creative. Oh, look at that income rate. Not bad. Not bad at all. Anyway, 
I think we have built one of each of these. We have... Oh, I never built the pirate ship. Yes, we have a pirate ship, finally. Where should we build it, though? We could build it here. We'll say it's a pirate ship that ran aground. Bring that up there. Let's do yellow. Let's be a little different this time. And we'll call this shipwreck. And open it. I think we can charge $5 for this when it opens. Yeah, people are getting in line for it. That's good. Let's do a quick inventory of our rides. What are people not on? No one's in the maze. It might just be because people aren't interested. Oh, yep. There we go. Shipwreck, zero. Spiral slide, zero. Oh, yeah, because it's way too expensive. Let's restore it to its original default price and see if people will start to ride it again. Anybody? Oh, there we go. All right. So now everything has people on it. Nothing is overpriced. That's good. Let's do a quick intermission and quack the heck out of these ducks. Get quacked, you feathered fiend! Yes. All right. What else can we do? What are we researching? Ooh, a new roller coaster. Let's see what we get. Oh, but first, let me turn this load down a bit. Just stop paying interest on it. Spinning wild mouse. That's kind of a pain to build, but it's uh, it's unique, I guess. It's fun. We're making all kinds of money, and we're not even running advertisements. We probably should be, though. As soon as I get some cash, let's, uh... Boom! Advertise park. Let's advertise the rickety rails as well. Where is it? Rickety rails. We can't afford it. Let's do some quick borrowing. There we go. Spend money to make money, as they say. Alright. Now, we have a new roller coaster, but we have no money to build it. Oh yeah, we have this one too, but I don't want to build it. I don't like that one. Okay, this will be a challenge to connect it to the path, so I'll probably build it over here, outside of the path. There we go. I think that's level with the path. Yeah, I'm pretty sure that's level. Okay. Maximum number of cars! Actually, that's overkill. Let's not do that. Right to the edge of the park. And we're out of money! Woohoo! That's a funky pattern. That's cool. We should probably be testing this in the background. Shouldn't we? Bump that up to six. And that's not gonna work. Why did I do that? Heh <laughs> heh. That's a rather abrupt turn right there. That'll knock someone out, I think. Let's do it again. More intensity. Let's do some little mini airtime hops here. Drop this down, get some... Okay, is breezing just fine over those hills? These little single... Single car roller coasters have a tendency to get stuck, and it's super annoying. Oh, 
All right, from 40 to 30, that should work just fine. From 20 to, that is the path, that's not gonna work. Now how about if I do it like this? Okay, that works, okay. I can't do that. Okay. <clears throat> Let's turn. And I think this is long enough. Let's bring it back to the station. Not like that. Let's have a wind down section here. We kind of use up all the remaining momentum of the cars. Can I do that? No, I can't do that. Okay. Um... So that'd be too abrupt. Ooh, that looks too abrupt. Okay, let's not do that. Let's just take it easy here. At 10 feet, I think. Now, let's do this. Oh, I'm in the way of myself. Our advertising campaign for the park is finished and for the re the, 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 the railroad is finished. Alright. Well, we'll have to restart that in a minute. But first, let's get this sorted out. Now, isn't that beautiful? All right. Fire it up! And I turned that up all the way. That's good. I get eight cars. Let's turn down the, the wait time a bit. Okay. We are nearly halfway through year two. It is May 13th. And things are going well. We have almost reached our objective. As soon as we open this ride, we certainly will pass it because this will attract another 90 or 100 guests to the park, I think. I don't know, something to do with the soft cap. Let's watch these laterals, make sure we're not gonna overshoot it anywhere. Okay, I was a little worried about that end spot, but it looks like it's gonna be all right. Okay, let's get our test results. Hoo-hoo, not bad. Very, very good. Crank that up to $15 and open for business. And let's fix this color problem. There we go. Fun color scheme. Obviously it's been used many, many times for the particular reason that it's just that good. Now, I guess the yellow tent is fine. Oh, we have a looping roller coaster now. Nice. Or as it's called in the uh, original game, the steel roller coaster. Which is weird, because most of the roller coasters are made of steel. I mean, this is steel. This is steel. But this is just called the steel roller coaster. Okay. Let's turn off this silly canvas tent so I can see what I'm doing. How long of a train do I get? Longer? Very long. Still very... Okay, that's what I want to see. this, I think I can do... I don't have room for this. No! Okay. Instead... We'll do a little airtime hop here. 
I don't have room for that either. What the heck? Okay. What for the, the steep way? Let's go. Powered launch without passing station. I don't know if this is available in the base game, but we're using it. Okay, let's see if this will account for the launch. Yep, there we go. That went through a little fast for comfort. Oh, I'm frozen again. No! Yeah, that's not safe. Let's change this to 40 and see what 40 looks like. A little more modest through the loop, but still a bit fast for my liking. Okay, whatever we do, we still need, we certainly need that last piece. Payday! It's raining, ladies and gentlemen. Let's uh, slow this down again to 34. We'll see what that looks like. There we go. And I think that'll do it. Let's test it for real and build our entrance for it. Very nice. Oh, it looks like we have less guests now. Even though we opened this. Oh, that's probably because all the advertisements finished. That's right. Many of those guests weren't from the soft cap. Those are just uh, uh, artificially generated guests from the advertisements. Anyway, not bad for stats. Let's uh, change the price on this to $12 and open up for business. Even though it's raining, which is uh, a shame. Okay, there's some fun colors for you. Let's go abstract. All right. Now with two new roller coasters open, now we should certainly exceed 750 given a month or two for that soft cap to fill up. That being said, let's advertise the park again. And we'll advertise the new looper. Looping roller coaster one. Okay. And we'll call this uh, Turbo Fans. Turbo Fans, because there's two of them. It's a jet. Sort of. Before the fuel is sprayed into it and ignited. Are people going to mind? Are people going to Okay, good. Nice. How much money is this ride generating? 18,000 per hour. Not bad. It looks like this is a slight backup in guests, though. I think. Yeah, I think we're going to turn this down just a tad. Hopefully that'll speed up throughput. We have a bit of a mess in the park. I think we need to hire more of these guys. And definitely another one of those guys. Duck time! There we go! Ruffled his feathers. What is this doing financially? Still producing a lot. It has produced well, a substantial amount of cash for us. That's good to see. Our loan is almost paid off, and look at this park coming together. We have one, two, three, four roller coasters, plus a log flume. So five, if you count the log flume. Plus several flat rides and uh oh something broke down let's look at our options again we still have the same old same olds nothing new i guess we could build a water ride what the heck just a uh, just for the aesthetic perhaps uh bumper boats I think guests will still get stuck under this if I let them.
You know, we'll just see what happens. Um, yeah, this will be interesting. Oh, we have we have food finally! Hooray! You poor guests can finally eat. And let's change this price to two dollars. Boom! Do we have any other food that I just missed? Okay, no, we totally don't. All right. Let's add our Q line to this. I missed. There we go. One more here. Shaboom. Wait, wait, wait. No, no, no. I want bumper boats because of the stat bonuses. Woohoo! Okay, I thought they were stuck for a second because of the bridge. <laughs> okay, well, it looks like they can go under the bridge. But if the same few people just get stuck out here for forever, we'll have to uh, close it down and build a track that they're uh, strictly forced to follow. And it looks like we have beat the scenario. We have 783 guests. 85 now. That's good. Possibly because of our advertising that we're doing. But yeah, we won. Now we just have to wait it out. So, let's populate the park with more cool stuff. And I was dissing on this ride before, but let's just build one just so we can say we have it. Can this helix? It cannot. That's a shame. Okay. The haunted house broke down. Oh no! How sad. I think I should have thought this through better. <laughs> this isn't gonna work, is it? No! No! Okay, looks like we have a shorter station. Great. So this ride exists strictly as an aesthetic ride, not because it's actually useful. Uh. There we go. Nicer colors. Okay, we go with four vehicles. No, we get three. <laughs> oh no, they're trains though. Oh, interesting. So this is different from Roller Coaster Tycoon 2, or maybe this isn't Roller Coaster Tycoon 2. I just missed it if it is. Let's flatten that and build a path. There we go. Looks like I had no trouble making it through the circuit. I'm used to these things stalling as they go, which is kind of frustrating. Stats, not bad. I probably didn't incur any stat penalties. So let's set that to eight bucks. Eight bucks a pop. So that finishes off all the roller coaster types we could have possibly built, except we're building, we're learning a new one. Uh, but yeah, that's all the roller coasters. So we have one of everything in our park. Unless you, unless you count all this stuff, which I don't. <laughs> I don't want to count it. It's too much work. Uh, let's actually see if there's anything. Okay, yeah, there's these variants as well. I built this one, not these two. Let's just group those back together. Yeah, there's not really much room to do much else. I could probably cram a few more rides in a few spaces, but... At this point, let's just pay off our loan and see what happens for the rest of the park. Although I will advertise the... Where is it? Rickety rails. Boom! Okay, loan's paid off. Let's speed things up. Woohoo! Spin! Woohoo! I don't know why I get excited about crap like that. What's wrong with me? Let's do some fast forward duck quacking.
Come back. Come back. He's too quick for me. All right, anyway. We are quickly acquiring money. Restart that. Do this one again for the looper. Where is it? Turbo fan. Very nice. We're halfway through year two. Amassing large amounts of cash. Look at that. I think that's the greatest income to date that we have. Yep. The most profit to date. Good to see. Good to see. And it's payday. Buy umbrellas, everybody. Should I build another umbrella stand somewhere? I probably could. Let's just plop one down right there. Change these to yellow. So now we have all the primary colors plus yellow. Restart our ad campaigns again. Let's make this six months this time. Or no, six weeks. Not six months. What am I saying? And uh, a log flume. Seems like something we can advertise. Okay, so we made less in August than we did in July. That's a shame. Although we made up for it in shop sales because of the rainstorm, it appears. Is anything not being ridden? That might explain it if some of these have expired. Aha! No one is riding the haunted house, and why? Because it's too expensive. All right. So we'll fix that. What about the rickety rails? No one is riding it. Same reason, it's too expensive. Okay, let's knock this down to $10. That should fix it, I hope. Shipwreck. I shouldn't have expected this to last long. Let's cut that in half, see if people will ride it now. Suspended mini coaster. I can't find mini suspended coaster. Well, I mean, it's not that hard to find. It's just a... Uh, actually, good point. Where is it? Oh, it's over here. <laughs> It's on the edge of the park. That's why you can't find it. Oh, wait, no. It's because... <laughs> this whole time it's been up and generating money because I failed to connect the path. <laughs> oh, my gosh. That's embarrassing. <clears throat> anyway, let's turn that up. Yeah, there we go. People are paying for it. Wonderful. Pizza! Delicious! Let's have a pizza stall right there. Bump this up to $2. Boom. Anything else we missed that we have unlocked in that fast forward session? Aha! A wooden wild mouse. Let's definitely build one of those somewhere. Not over there, not over there. Maybe crammed in. Yeah, we've really used up all the space we have available. I could build one here if I flatten the land a little bit. Maybe. Okay. Wooden Wild Mouse. Let's go. Oh, I should have. Shouldn't have done that. Okay. I like making these super, super compact. From... What is that? 65 to 55? Let's go right over the station here. This should be testing in the background, I think, which I was not doing. I should have thought that through. And what is in the way here? I can't see what I'm doing. Something's in the way. I uh, see through supports. Oh, that's what's in the way. Okay. In that case, we'll do it like... Oh, no, it's still in the way. No! Okay, fine. I see how it is. Okay. And sports back on. So 
from 35 to 30. Okay, that works just fine. Wonderful. And I think the station is at 15 feet elevation, so let's flatten out. Little mini hop like that, and return to station. Just like that. And we don't have access to brakes, so I sure hope that that works out. Make the station platform longer, so we have more mice on it. Okay. Alright, now I'm not sure why the mouse color is the same color as everything else. I guess that is a realistic color. Let's make these white mice. With uh, cheese crumbs on them. Which is actually just the whatever those yellow things are. Uh, where the support bars connect to. Anyway, the speed of the lift hill to the maximum of 5 miles per hour. Not particularly fast. Bum, 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 bum. Ba -ba -da -da -da. I love how that's a meme song that plays in this game. Or historically, it was meant to be a meme. And it looks like to pull this off, I have to screw up this path. Get off the path, people! Run for your lives! There we go. Troubleshooting, just like that. Now everyone's lost. Alright, and I think I'd fail to turn this down. So let's turn that down to five seconds. Oh, nice! Nice stats, my goodness. Well, <laughs> we can charge a lot for this. Woohoo! Let's go! Now let's see if the station decongests now that I turned the wait time down. Maybe, hopefully. It's totally not. I think the station's too long for such a short track. Let's change that to three seconds. It's still congested. Maybe two seconds? My goodness, let's just turn it off. Okay, anyway, we have a lot of money. Oops, did not mean to click that. Actually, this is nothing on it. Nobody on it, I mean. Okay, eight dollars. Will people pay eight dollars? He will. Nice. Okay, good to see this is producing lots of money. Uh, what new rides do we have that I missed? Oh, we have an inverted roller coaster? Really? Oh, ho, ho, ho! I, uh, we totally don't have room for this, but we're gonna make room, because this is a super mega powerful roller coaster. If I can make it fit. We're gonna make it fit, ladies and gentlemen. We're gonna make this happen. Let's go plain so I can see what we're doing. I never thought I'd like this color scheme, but yellow and white, that actually looks pretty good. And I think I want to make this go down like that. So I can fit my trains in. Yes, yeah, so we have one train, two trains. That's the difference. Alright. Turn that off, turn that off. Let's make this tall! Woohoo! And, of course, I do not have room for that. That's where the merry-go-round is. What if I go up? There we go. <laughs> I don't have, don't have enough speed for that. Let's go taller. Because we can. It looks like this roller coaster gives us access to banked sloped turns. In Roller Coaster Tycoon 1. Okay. Okay. Let's get a photo of our terrified friends' faces. 
Can I come out through there? I cannot. Okay. And what else can I do here? Uh, I just did that. Looks like I've locked myself in. That is the edge of the park. I cannot do that. Okay. I did not think I could do that either. Okay. So with that, let's come down like so. Cannot do that. That's a shame. You know, I try to avoid straight sections, but maybe here we need one. We went from 120 to... No, I don't have room for that. To, uh, what is this? 20 feet. <laughs> I don't have room for this. Okay. Let's break all of that. And let's see, where are we? Let's try right. Oh, look at that. We can do it. We can do it. You know, I like this color, but I want it to stand out. And there's this roller coaster has white support, so let's make this blue. Okay, that blends the water too much. Oh, better yet. Yellow. Or <laughs> yellow. <laughs> Red with yellow supports. There, now we're talking. Now we're talking business. Hello, bumper boats. I may delete that so I can put this here. Now I think I'm going to do that. Let's delete it. The heck? Oh, wait, how did you drown? He was drowning while the path was still there. Normally when you delete the ride, they get ejected to the exit. <laughs> how did that happen? It don't make no sense. All right, whatever. Anyway, back to what we were doing. As if I could be bothered by the untimely deaths of our guests. Oh no, you underestimate my ruthlessness. I'm just kidding, that actually is a shame, but eh, what, no. what could I possibly do about it? Okay, so this would be the height to connect back to the station. Let's not do that, of course. Although we should uh, come out of this. And there's a chairlift there. Shoot. Let's go. Woo! <laughs> Actually, do I have, do I have enough room for this? Because I know that. Okay, just making sure. Because I know that the, uh... Oh, no! My queue line! I know that the, uh... The inverted coasters take more vertical space than regular roller coasters like this one. And I have a feeling that this twist is going to be a major, major G-force inducer. Dangerously so. Let's go half loop. That's not gonna work. Maybe if I do it here? That still goes to 80 feet. I really doubt it's going to make it up to that. So let's get out of it and see what happens. Okay, where is the train? There it is, okay. 
Nope. I was afraid of that. Okay, fine. Let's instead do it here. Corkscrew out of here. Corkscrew right. And this lines us not up. Okay, maybe if I do it like this. No, now I'm crashing into the thing. Okay. Now we should be lined up. Alright, let's put some brakes on here. Slow this down to 13. I have a feeling this monstrosity is going to be uh, a bit heavy on the G-forces somewhere. Or at least high on the stats. Anyway, that being said, let's test it anyway. I expect this is going to be quite a fun ride. Alright, let's turn up the lift hill to the maximum speed. And test. While I build the path. Let's give this something exclusive. Oh, wow. More options. Okay. I think I want to... You know what, screw it. We'll figure that out later. Where's train one? Oh my, what a bustling park. Woohoo! Oops. Hello, Alicia. Just trying to click on this roller coaster. Alright, let's watch these G-forces and make sure we don't do anything too crazy. Everything looks good. Just breeze over that hill. Okay, it looks like the, lad the, the barrel roll wasn't as bad as I thought it would be. Very nice. Okay, now I expect this to not have any problems. Let's see. Now those are some crazy stats. 747. Would it be weird if I called this Jumbo Jet? Just because of the stats. <laughs> okay, what is in the way here? Oh, I see what's going on. There we go. Alright. Now let's figure this thing out. Uh, let's go with this one. Classy. Well, I think we can get away with $16 for this monstrosity. Now do I really want to make this red? I don't know. What do you guys think? I, you know, it's funny. I ask that as if you could actually answer as I record this. Maybe I should stream and ask you guys things like that. I don't know. <laughs> but there is a lot of red going on in this park already. Like there's a bit of it here. There's it's on the Ferris wheel. It's on these. You know, let's change the Ferris wheel. Let's make this blue. Not blue, green. Dang it! It's like everything blends with something. Just can't win. But anyway, people are starting to get in line, it appears. It is April 17th, year 3. So we should have plenty of time to advertise for 12 weeks, because that is the roughly the equivalent of 3 months. Let's advertise our new inverted roller coaster. Where is it? Inverted roller coaster 1 for 12 weeks. Boom! Okay. Now let's change the theme here. Very nice. Very, very nice. Okay, let's switch these. Let's make that a little darker, make the rails brighter. 
Now let's just make it all better. And these trains can be Okay, they really don't stand out much against the track. Blue and yellow? How about blue and red? No, that doesn't work. And there goes the merry-go-round. It just kicked the bucket. No! No, I kind of like the blue, actually. Even though it blends with the background a little bit. I don't know! This, this looks cool. Look at that. Look at that! What a fleshed-out park. We have crammed so much stuff into this little space. Although this area is a little barren. Do we have any new things I missed while I was engrossed constructing our new roller coaster? Ooh, we have a miniature railroad. How, in, how would we ever use that? <laughs> that would never work here. Let's see. What have we... Okay, we're, okay, we just learned the railroad. Anything I missed? Oh my goodness. A lot of people drowned. <laughs> but why, though? <laughs> I just demolished it. Oh, I think I know why. It's because I closed it first and then demolished it. But when you close it, they go to the inside of the exit. But when I demolished it, the exit disappeared. So I should have waited a minute first. That's a shame. I did not mean to do that. Ugh. Oh, well. Rocket cars? What a waste. What the heck? We don't need rocket cars. Anyway, I think it's time we start duplicating some of our flat rides throughout the park, just to flesh it out. Have more stuff. Oh, hold on. Guests are complaining about the disgusting state of the paths in my park. Okay, where are you and where are you complaining from? Oh, yeah. I don't blame you. That's disgusting. <laughs> where are these guys? What is it about this strip of land that makes it so gross? I think we should assign this guy to this spot. Oops, a daisy. There we go. Now that place is assigned to somebody. Let's give him the entrance to. Uh oh, it's payday! Woohoo! Okay. Our park rating has maxed out at 990. Uh, no, it's 991. Okay. I think it'll max out in a second now that we've cleaned some paths up. But, uh. Anyway. Yeah, that's basically it. The scenario is pretty much over. We have crammed so much stuff into this tiny little space on these uh, the three islands, the Trinity Islands, as it's called. The first of the challenging parks. And what 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 was supposed to be challenging about this? Uh, well, I guess it was kind of hard dealing with the terrain, but it wasn't that hard. Uh, anyway, I guess I think Mars of Oz did actually talk about how the uh, difficulty curve of this game is very good, meaning that the first of the difficult parks would be just slightly harder than the last of the beginner part, so that makes sense. So I guess I shouldn't be too, bra too braggadocious about my own skill. It's not, I'm not particularly skillful. I just, you know, it's not particularly hard. I just wanted an excuse to use the word braggadocious. <laughs> it's such a funny word. <laughs> That's the only reason I said that. Anyway, what are we researching now? So now we have the classic mini roller coaster, mini roller coaster cars, rocket cars, blah, 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 tongue twister. What are we researching now? Come on. It's raining again. Yay, payday. There we go. Park raining is maxed out. And I think we're going to finish the scenario with a thousand guests. Look at that. 
Oh, a new shopper stall. Cool. Let's advertise for free... Free fries with your pizza. And free rides on the merry-go-round. There we go. Now we have a thousand people in the park. Oh, we have a balloon stall. Yes! Yes, 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 yes. We are... Now we can have a, our customary balloon release. Make this free. Same price throughout park. We'll leave that at the default. Let's place a few more throughout the park. One here. Make these ones red. One right there. Make these ones yellow. That's all the primary colors. Now let's do the secondary colors. Come on, face that way. There we go. Make this one green. Light green. Right there. This one can be orange. Now for purple. Alright, that's all the primaries and all the secondaries. Now let's add pink to the mix. Which isn't a primary or a secondary, it's kind of its own category, I guess. Pink. I guess it's just a hue of red, honestly. You know, that's an interesting thing. We think of pink and red as separate colors. Why do we think of them as separate colors? They're the same color. They're just hues of the same color. Just like we have dark blue and light blue. That's the only difference. Red and pink. The only difference is like pink should be over here. I mean, even this. This is a variant of red. It's a kind of pink. Have you ever thought of it like that? Anyway, we could do uh, white balloons. Unless, wait, was this the pink ones? I think this is the pink ones. I need to do a separate one for white. Uh, break that. Now pink, not pink, white, can be right there. White balloons. But not black balloons. I've done black balloons before with white, and it kind of just muted the colors a little bit. Maybe I should delete the white ones. It's just not very colorful. Ah, whatever. It's a minority. Just one stall out of so many. We are in June 18th, about halfway through this, uh, the last year of the scenario. Does anything not have people on it? Okay, this one is too expensive, so let's drop it to something we know people will be willing to pay for. What else has no one on it? Turbo fans, probably too expensive. Yep, too expensive. Make that a bit cheaper. And I think that's it. Everything should start have people start riding them soon. Yeah, people are getting in line for the log flumes. And people are getting in line for the looper. Alright, that's it. Now I think we should... That is not what I wanted. We should... That would have been a disaster if I accidentally deleted all my scenery. That'd be, that'd be tragic. Let's mow our grass. With this cheap trick. Instead of hiring Handyman to do it, I just do it myself. Ho ho! Look at that. Beautiful. Reset to the default. Now in these last few months, I think we should decorate with some flowers. Even though the terrain doesn't really allow for it. Actually, can we, uh... Maybe some flowers in here. Da 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 Da, da, da. What other colors? Let's do these ones. Put some... I did bricks on the other one. Let's do these fences around these ones. This cute little flower bed. Probably should not place them on the beach. They would get killed by the salt water, no doubt. There's not a lot of space to plant flowers here, is there? Maybe we should just spam more trees. So what, what are the common kinds we have? We have... I think we have some of these. I know we have lots of these. Montezuma pine trees. Let's have some palm trees, because this is in the beach, after all. J 
Just more trees, I say. We can't have too many trees. Oh, and this one is here naturally. Okay. And now some magnolia trees to border our paths right here. These are pretty. Where else can we plant these? This is a, well, that's a fruit tree. Okay. Just more color. And let's shove some bushes into the mix. So we don't just have trees. We have a more realistic looking forest with lots of underbrush. Lots of underbrush. Oops, let's not move a whole support just for that one plant. <laughs> oh, we could have uh, something cute right there. There we go. Let's have some more fountains here round and about. On either side of this drop. That's cool. And maybe some cattails out in the water. Maybe some swampier areas of the lagoon. Or the bay, or I don't know. What am I saying? Okay, we're now on July 6th. Looks like we missed Independence Day. What a shame. July 4th, American Independence Day. What else? Ooh, we have a dinghy slide. Also known as the, uh, the people crusher. Or the, the crasher. But I could build a small one, and if I use this tube thing, it uh, won't kill anybody. I don't have room to build this anywhere. Oh, maybe I have room over here. Maybe. That's a big maybe. Maybe not. Yeah, <laughs> maybe not. I don't have room to build it anywhere. Yeah, never mind. No room. Anyway, back to scenery! Let's put some nice little dolphins somewhere. Maybe in the entrance to the park. Oh, I don't want to have it supported. That would look funny. Oh, I see where we can put them. Right here. Oops, not like that. Facing inside. Like so. There we go. And maybe some magnolia trees to go here. By the entrance of everything. Here's the split. Here's the space we could uh, have some flowers, I think. Let's do these ones, which we can custom color. Let's get a more radiant red color. I like the way we can build the flowers up off the ground like that. That's silly. I actually don't like the way that looks. Let's not do that. Uh, bricks. There we go. Now for some trees. Magnolia trees. And perhaps some flowers. Or no, bushes. Or small trees. Yeah. Because those fit in these areas where you can't fit anything else. Okay, well things are looking very, very good, and the year is a little over halfway over. Look at how much money we have, my goodness. Our proc value is not bad. We have 1,180 guests, and not much else, not much room to do anything else. Oh, but here's an open space I might be able to squeeze something in. Do we have any more flat rides? No, we just have the dinghy slide. Huh. Well, the problem here is because the path is right up against the hillside, I can't build anything there and then have a path go down to it. Ah, anyway, might as well quack some ducks while I'm here. That's right. You know how, the, you know how it goes, Mr. Duck. Let's see what inventory of our rides again. Two breakdowns. That's not good. Everything has at least one rider. That's a good sign. 
These guys are overworked. Okay, that should be good. Our park rating is still maxed out at 999. That's good. Shipwreck has broken down. No! What we could do is put some more flat rides out here on the water. So perhaps another... Actually, that's a bad idea. It's a noisemaker. Another Ferris wheel. Right here on the water. And why do we have such a funny color for... Oh. I see what's going on here. Test. Rest in peace, little tree. It just had to be like that. Now that's connected. Very good. Open that for business. And that will attract even more people to the park. Oh, I see flat space I didn't fill out. We could put some flowers here. Let's grab some delicious pre-boxed flowers. It's a check over here. Minimal effort. Right at the top of that little hill. <laughs> Any other flat spots we missed? Okay, that just looks funny. Let's not do that. Spinning Wild Mouse 1 still hasn't been fixed. Okay, now he's fixing it. Maybe it's just because the, the park is too big. Man, that's a lot of people. Woohoo! Got some cute little pink flowers there. Okay. Let's get back to the spammage of scenery. With trees! Maybe a few walnut trees. Oh no, those are oak trees, not walnuts. This is the walnut tree. And some more palm trees. Let's actually delete these palm trees so we can put some flowers there. Maybe these cute pink ones. Lovely. Yeah, they grow right here. Look at that. Let's actually, do we have any like dead bushes we could plant? I guess the, lily, the, the cattails kind of look like that. Yeah, that works. Okay. Fountains. Ooh, we got cotton candy. Delicious. Where do we want to place that? Right there. I'm going to leave that the default price. Cotton candy for everybody. No need to overpay. I feel generous today. That rhymes, but not by design. That also rhymed. <laughs> that was not by design either. Maybe I could do a train shuttle thing. Just so I have one of each of everything. Let's see, what train types do I have access to? Okay, just the steam trains, okay. I have a feeling this is not gonna work. Yeah, that's not gonna work. I'm not gonna be able to get the path set up over here. Where else could I potentially build? Huh. Hey, looks like we're gonna have a storm! Uh-oh. Can you imagine being one of the poor souls stuck on here? Oh, there's no one... Is there no one on the ride? Okay, here's someone stuck on the ride. New phobia unlocked! Stuck on a broken chairlift. <laughs> Hello! No, 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 let me click on you. Look at that grin, he's so happy. Couldn't be more pleased to be stuck on a chairlift. But why is he starving? I have food. A few pieces, things of food. Maybe we just need more. 
More food and more locations. That's actually probably a good idea to keep people in the park, is actually having more food stalls. So people don't go home from hunger. Okay. Well, this one, I'm just wasting time, so let's just speed up. Look at it go, all the little things moving around. Woohoo! Man, this car ride is still producing. And it's produced 3,000 for us. I guess it's a 100% return on investment. Because <laughs> I think I spent about 1,500-ish on it to build it. It's not bad. Not bad at all. We have a pretty steady income of about 10 to 13,000 per month. On average. Yeah, about on average. Okay. Except July. We made a ton in July. My goodness. Woohoo! Look at them go! Do we have anything new I'm mostly paying attention to? Okay, we have reversed trains for the looping roller coaster. I just remembered that reversing the trains on this does not change anything at all. You have to have a train where the designated type is reversed to make a difference. See, there's the stats. Now it looks forward. Oh, <laughs> there's a little hack for you. So if you don't like the way it looks when it faces for when it faces backwards, but you want the stats, you can use reverse trains and just flip them around. I just realized I never I never realized that. That's hilarious. Look at that. Pro tip for all you players on Open RCT2. <laughs> all right. What did that do to the stats? Woohoo! That made a way higher on the intensity. Okay. We are super rich. We are almost to the end. What else? Suspended swinging coaster? Isn't that what we already have? Oh, mini suspended. Okay. We get that on the 2nd of October, huh? I want to see if that's a separate roller coaster or if that gets lumped in with the one we already have. There it is. Yep, it's lumped in. What the? Why does this have a separate look to it? So the looping roller coaster looks like that, but if I uncategorize... Oh, this is the icon for reversed trains. Got it. Okay. Mini suspended coaster. What did I even unlock? Suspended swinging coaster. Oh, this one! Oh, I need to learn how to read. <laughs> well, we don't have room to build that anywhere. It is too big and too clunky to cram into this tiny space we have. So yeah, I'm going to fast forward again. I want to see a massive balloon release. Look at all the people who have balloons now that we made them free. Woohoo! There's a handful of people riding on the, the BUI. The bug under the influence. Look at them spiraling around backwards. <laughs> Does anything... Oh my goodness, we have a hundred people on here. We have a tenth of our park on the chairlift. Or I guess an eleventh, technically. We have an eleventh... That's a hard thing to say. Eleventh... Th th of the uh, of our guests on this chairlift. The spinning wild mouse has nobody on it, probably because it's too expensive, so let's knock that down 33% to $10. And watch as that changes. Everything else seems to be doing okay. Let's find our spinning wild mouse. Is anybody gonna get in line? Come on, peeps! No one's interested. That's a shame. He's broke. Yeah, everyone's broke. Because there's no there's no ATMs in, in Roller Coaster Tycoon 1, as I've, I've been informed. Someone told me in the comments that ATMs aren't actually in this game. Oh, there we go. Someone's getting in line. Very nice. Anyway. I'm just stalling. <laughs> da 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 da. Woohoo! Oh yeah, it's playing the song that I like. Da 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 da. Oh look at the look at the pixel animation from up close. That's weird. Let's slow it down. 
Look at that! What the heck? And somehow from far away that just makes it look like it's spinning. That is really neat. Huh. I never really zoomed in on that. <laughs> anyway, it looks like we win! As always, thank you so much for watching. This has been tremendous fun to record. If you like the video, be sure to leave a like and subscribe so you see when the next video comes out. Until then, have a great rest of your day, and goodbye. Man, look at all these balloons. <laughs>